With 16 mainline entries, sequels, spin-offs, and expansions, newcomers to the Final Fantasy series may feel overwhelmed when looking for a place to start. Thankfully, almost every Final Fantasy title is standalone, so these are some of the very best ones to start with. Released at the height of open world games really gaining popularity, Final Fantasy XIII was heavily criticized for being linear. In the time since release, fans have come around on Final Fantasy XIII and its two sequels for a variety of reasons, including enjoying the protagonist Lightning and her journey. One of the last entries with turn-based combat, the focus is welcome for newcomers first approaching the series, and visually it still does look nice today. The latest mainline title, Final Fantasy XVI, embraces modern action combat found in games like Devil May Cry 5 and God of War to tell a gripping, darker story. Full of bombastic boss battles with expensive looking visuals and set pieces, the journey of Clive Rossfield is certainly a spectacle that most will be able to appreciate. Getting two DLCs to add to its lengthy campaign, there's a lot of game here. If turn-based combat isn't your thing, you should look into this entry. If your knowledge and interest of Final Fantasy is purely based on Cloud and Sephiroth, Final Fantasy VII Remake is a great place to start your journey with the series. While the original title is viewed as one of the best games ever made, with many fans beginning their journey here, for more modern gamers, they may have a hard time going back to the 1997 classic. The remake series has the hindsight of the original game and all its spin-offs to present the story of Cloud and his friends in a more comprehensive way, with astonishing visuals and tactical real-time combat. Final Fantasy VII Remake covers just one part of the original story, with 2024's Final Fantasy VII Rebirth continuing the adventure, and one final game is coming to conclude the project. If you do like retro pixel RPGs, the last Final Fantasy game in this style, Final Fantasy VI, is the peak of the franchise for many. Not only does the game still look great thanks to the frequency of modern pixel-based releases today, the soundtrack and story are some of the best the series has ever seen. With a surprisingly easy to understand battle system, new players will surely be in for an unforgettable classic when they play this entry. The first Final Fantasy game for the PlayStation 2, the technical leap made in Final Fantasy X is remarkable. While it may not look as impressive as more recent entries, Final Fantasy X's real element that helps it stand above is its heart-wrenching story. Its turn-based combat system is incredibly intuitive, but hard to master, as is the game's sphere grid party composition system. With its own sequel, there may be no better place to learn what Final Fantasy is than with this entry. And those are some of the best places to start your journey with Final Fantasy. What catches your eye the most, and for veterans, where did you start? Be sure to let us know, and as always, stay tuned to Game Rant for more videos like this.